Welcome to my garden. As you can hear the fish pond tinkling away in the background. Church bells have stopped and the flowers are swaying gently in the breeze. Now I have something for you today and it's called a shining heart. Now the heart is a muscle that pumps blood through the body. Because it's only a muscle, it cannot sink. It cannot be sad and it can't be happy. It can't guide our actions. This is all done by our mind. And yet we use many expressions such as these. I want to serve you with all of my heart. I put all my heart into my work. My heart sympathizes with you. I love you with all my heart. When we're frightened or surprised, we often put our hands over our hearts like this. And civilians place the hand over the heart when they salute the flag. And I wonder why the heart was picked as the seat of the emotions. Why wasn't another muscle, such as the muscle in your right arm, chosen? Then we could say to our mothers, I love you with all the muscle in my arm. But somehow it doesn't seem appropriate to put it that way. Could it be possible that there's some emotional connection between the mind and the heart? And when we're frightened or excited or emotionally disturbed, our heart beats faster. Now, some years ago, there was a very important meeting taking place in San Francisco. It was a conference. And a man who was attending the conference was walking down Market Street when he saw above the shoe shine shop this sign, let a good shine inside. Get a good shine inside. He looked at his shoes and decided that they needed to be polished. And he went inside. Now the shoe shine boy put all his energy into shining the shoes. And soon there was such a shine on this man's shoes that he had never seen before. He paid for the shine. And as he was leaving, the shoe shine boy put his hand on the man's arm and said, I hope your heart shine today just like your shoes. This impressed the man so much that he told his friends and they told others and all during that conference time this shoe shine boy had a big business shining everybody's shoes just because they wanted him to say I hope you heart shine today just like your shoes and they were never disappointed. It's good to keep your shoes polished and to keep your clothing neat and clean. But really, it is much more important that the heart be clean. If the heart shines, our shoes will be polished, our clothing will be neat, and our whole being will tell that we love and serve our Lord and Master. Hope you enjoy.